Hello everyone, Jamie here. So some awful news. I found out today that YouTube Vanced will be closing down. I love that app. It had all these premium features built in, like no ads, and you could uh, do picture in picture, but it will be taken down soon because Google has demanded it. Now the link will be going within the next few days. I will put another link in the description below uh, so you can still install it from a different website. And it should carry on working for about two more years, so I've read. But in case it doesn't and we need to get a replacement app um, I've got a new one that I'll show you so here we go so if you want the link to download this new app called new pipe I will put the link in the description okay so we've gone onto the app and we've got a trending page here um, if you go to the middle tab the one with the TV looking icon we're gonna click on that and when you if you want to sign into YouTube uh, we're gonna go to the middle option where it says YouTube and it's gonna come up with instructions but I will show you how to do it so you don't have to bother reading it uh, you do however have to click on the top link so we're just gonna click on that okay and then we're gonna scroll down till we get to where it says products I'm gonna deselect all of them and then we're gonna select YouTube and then we're going to go for that option there that says all YouTube data included. So I'm going to click on that. Okay, I'm going to deselect all of that information uh, apart from subscriptions. So we're just going to make sure that one's been ticked. I'm going to click on OK. Okay, and then I'm going to click on Next Step. Okay, so um, by default, it will send you the link to this file uh, by email, um, or you can use Dropbox, OneDrive. Uh, normally it has another one for Google Drive, but for some reason it's not on here at the moment. It was about five minutes ago when I tried it out. Uh, but anyway, we're gonna scroll down, I'm gonna click on Create Export. Okay, and then we're gonna get an email come through and it's gonna say, download your files. We've got an option here. Okay, once you've signed in, I'm gonna click on that. Okay, and once that's downloaded, it's gonna go down to your download folder. Uh, but we're gonna go back to new pipe, we're gonna click on that. And can you see at the bottom, it says import file. So I'm gonna click on that, and it should take you to your download folder. And the file will be called takeout. So I'm gonna click on that. And then uh, make sure that you're on Wi-Fi. You can do it on mobile data if you want, uh, but it does say that it can be expensive. So if you've got a lot of data, then uh, make sure you're on Wi-Fi and click on okay. At the bottom it's uh, coming up saying it's importing. There we go, that didn't take long, so we're just gonna go back one screen. Okay, and if you look at the bottom, you can see all the channels that I've subscribed to. Um, if you want to see all the latest videos, all we need to do is click on all at the top left, and it will show you all the uh, all the videos of my um, channels that I've subscribed to, um, all, the, all the latest ones. So that's really cool, that's, that's really good. I'll just show you something else before I go. Uh, we'll just come out of that. Press the three lines at the top left, I'm going to go down to settings. I'm going to go to video and audio and you've got a bunch of settings on here so if you want to change your resolution so it shows a particular resolution you can change that here. Um, you can go through all of this yourself if you want to and it's got loads of different options. Uh, one important one here where it says minimize on app switch so if you are watching a video and you minimize it um, we want it to come up as a video at the bottom so we're just going to click on uh, minimize to pop up player the bottom option uh, you've got other little bits and bobs like you can fast forward it or rewind it um, like 5, 10, 15, whatever amount of seconds. Um, I like to have 5, you know when you double tap on the left hand side or the right hand side of the screen when watching the video you can go either fast forward or rewind. So I just thought I'd show you what the interface looks like um, for when you're watching videos. So you can do uh, your next lot of videos, you can just swipe over to the right hand side you can see the description of the video you've got what speed you want the video what resolution you want the video um, which is great um, and if you're playing a video I'm just make sure the volume's down play a video and then you minimize the screen see it will pop up see it'll pop up there and you can actually change the size of it if you want you can do pinch to zoom so if I do that pinch to zoom I can change the, the size of the, the player, which is really good. Okay, so that's a quick demonstration of how to use this app and how to install it. So if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And if you hated it, subscribe. Okay, thanks very much. Bye.